Audio, three, two, one. So remove the negative connotations that come with the term skid mark. Skid mark garage here in Cleveland, it's a community garage. People pull up, work on their bikes, and even if they don't know how, they teach you. How does this get going? How does it work? We're gonna find out. Brian? Will? So I bought an old bike and realized quickly that dealerships won't work on old bikes. So I was fixing it myself. Eventually, after hanging out with the guys in my garage all night and working, I kind of thought, what if I turned it into a business and everyone got to hang out with all their friends? Yeah. Did you just, take this one off? Yeah, this, they're all good. I look. It's in a huge space where all the music's playing. I figured fortune favors the bold, and I took a chance. People store their bikes here, too. Correct. That's the whole beauty of membership, is it's not sitting in your kitchen. But you know what? A bike in a kitchen sounds cool. It is cool. I'm not an interior decorator, cool. but I mean, as far as a guy's like bachelor pad, yeah, I, yeah, I yeah. like it. So where would you be doing this project, Eric, if it wasn't for Skidmark? Oh, I got a home garage. Oh, OK. But it's not cool. It's no not idiots good. show up with a camera in your home garage. <laughs> See, this is what I'm talking about. The guys like to stand around, what is that, a socket wrench? Turning a bolt there. Turning a bolt. There's a ton of rookies that don't know what they're doing. And then okay. there's tons of guys like Carl and Greg and Eric who will drop whatever they're doing to help everybody out. And I see everything here from like road hogs to crotch rockets. And full on custom crazy bikes where this guy's got car wheels on a motorcycle. You got a lounge area. I do. So every once in a while, someone will rent the place out. I had a wedding here. Everything you see is donated. And the bar was from a little place in Lakewood that went out of business. That couch was on, on a tree lawn on garbage day. Do you get like a lot of like Twilight Zone episodes oh, on this? And That would be the greatest. And when I have bands play here, it's just a fantastic backdrop. That thing blows my mind. Incredible. No wonder people want to come here. I don't know if you got a bike that we can screw up for someone else to come behind us. Greg's really tearing down this thing here. What's the time frame on a project like this? What are, you, what are we doing? What can I help you with? Check your rectifier. Your Wasn't what? Your, the rectifier. It's what charges the battery. I'm going to say, we're a family it, show. It, the thing needs to do a Johnson rod, too. Picked up on that. Get rid of that. We're we'll, we'll probably going to need a seat here. See, now I'm not just asking stupid questions anymore. What do you even call these? They're just acorn covers. The next guy that comes in here and goes, you know, I really want some acorn covers. Yeah. You're going to leave like these 90 yeah, of these 90, things. Yeah. <laughs> Whoa, you're just cracking it off, huh? Oh, yeah. You're saving the purple, though, right? On a scale of 1 to 10, how much help was I to you today? <laughs> well, I appreciate you uh, opening your doors for oh, me today. Oh, yeah, man. I'm going to have to come back when I get myself a bike. It's all you, man. Well, I already know how to take off the front fender.